Let's start with news from Sri Lanka. Political chaos in Sri Lanka is worsening and so is the chaos on the streets. Amidst dramatic escalation of events in Colombo, Sri Lankan Prime Minister Ranil Vikramasinghe appointed as the acting president of the crisis-hit country after President Gotabaya Rajapaksa fled overseas. A massive showdown is taking place in the capital city of Colombo. Protests are escalating with each passing minute. In the latest, protesters barged into Sri Lankan Prime Minister's office after he took over as the acting president. Protesters breached military defences, entered the Prime Minister's office. The Sri Lankan police and military are struggling to contain the growing protests. Lankan forces resorted to the use of tear gas to disperse the swelling crowds. And in a televised statement, Prime Minister Ranil Vikramasinghe instructed the military and police to do what is necessary to restore order. He is ordered to impose curfew in Western Province and emergency law island-wide with immediate effect. Now, early anti-government protesters also broke into the main state television station, took over the broadcast. An unidentified man barged into the studio of Rupa Vahini Network during a live program and ordered that only protest-related news should be broadcast. The transmission was later cut off. The massive public outrage comes after President Rajapaksa fled at the country during the wee hours on Wednesday. With his wife, two bodyguards and Antonov military aircraft to the Maldives. Now sources claim that the president will land in Malay, then head to some other destination. His resignation will reportedly be delivered to the speaker after he reaches his final destination. Gautabaya left the country in an alleged bid to avoid detention after stepping down. Now for more on this, our correspondent Dasuni Atoda has sent us this report from Colombo Listen In. Protests obviously intensified the second that the citizens got to know Prime Minister Anil Vikrama Singh has now been given the power to be the acting president of Sri Lanka. The speaker Mahindya Pabe Wardana in his address did say because President Gotabe Rajpaksa is overseas that Prime Minister Anil Vikrama Singh will now be vested with the power of becoming the acting president of Sri Lanka. Moreover, the speaker was also seen saying that President Gotabe Rajpaksa Rajapaksa will most certainly be handing over his letter of resignation at some point today, as mentioned before, where President Gotabe Rajapaksa was seen saying that on the 13th of July, that is today, he will be stepping down from his post of president. Beyond is now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.